lick me tongue for a miracle run. Oh, why, what a night, what a night, what a Saturday night. Why, what a night, what a night, what a Saturday night. Hear me, I'm the golden key, my bitch, I'm the one. Hear me, I'm the golden key, my bitch, I'm the one. Yeah. 
never you change. One day me and my friend was riding on his bike, but I was the one who was riding. I didn't have any license. And these police guys, they saw us ride and said, hey. And we did not stop because I said I was not going to stop because I did not have any license. So I speeded up and they they had better bikes than us, so they, they cornered us and banked us into a car. And when they banked me in the car, I panicked and jumped off of the bike and jumped the fence and this. I, I didn't even know that shots were firing, you know, to the way I was moving. I ran through the yard, jumped on a house top, jumped a fence in another yard. And when I jumped another fence and r tried to run off again, I just feel my foot just wobble away. And when I looked down on my foot, it was pure blood. And some people who was in the same yard with I run started to ball out, whoa, whoa, what's happened, what happened? I run into one of them house and it is just like I heard a lot of police siren going, whoa, 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 whoa. And the people were in the yard, they were so frightened, they run outside in the street and the police saw the alarm in the yard and they run, come in and they saw me underneath a bed and said, come out, boy. And they said, what you run for? And I was so confused, I didn't know what to say and they carried me outside and pushed me back into the car and they carried me back to the main road where I had jumped off of my, the bike. Well, when they carried me back, I saw my friend by the name of Ken. They had held him because he did not run. You know, I was the only one. I was so panicked and I didn't want to be held, so I ran and they carried me back. And a lot of traffic was blocked and a big, inspe a big police and an ins inspector, he was on the scene too and he came over and said, what happened? And this police, it was some S9 police who had ride me down and fire the shots and shot me. He said to them, what would happen? And Living according to the law of love, there is no condemnation, just love. Your sister in as you love yourself, and things will be much better for you and for I, and for everyone. For you and for I.
the condition of women in Jamaica is at a state that I think most women should be more, they should prepare themselves to fight along with the man, not in front of him or behind him, but beside him. They should become as one and fight to reach somewhere. It is very important. And I would, I would appeal to every woman to try to stand up with her man and fight. Push forward and not backward. This is Cedric Martin, lead singer of the Congos. Yeah, I was born in a little seaport town, in a ghetto, in the world I would be. See, during the passage of time, I go to school, I go to more than one school, time and patient, 
and uh, Linstead and Old Arbor Bay School. Yeah, through the run-ins. Well, when I was in school, I liked music, you know, as I abbey, you know. Music and cricket are my own personal abbey. And soccer, you know, true. Call upon the singers and the players of instruments. All the springs are in thee. It's a musical. It's a musical aeration that you're dealing right now. Musical aeration. Both spiritual and physical. Yeah? So, and our music is telling the nation of teaching them about his majesty, you know, the king of creation, word, sound, and power, you know, he's the word we speak, he keep us alive, see?
All the songs of them are judgment songs. For the wicked. You know? Judgment songs. Some of them is spiritual songs, yes. Soothing songs, soft songs, yes. But some of them is judgment songs. Some of the songs of them are issue, well, issue judgment. If I want to do anything, you just chant a song for him and you just feel it. You know what I mean? Eh? He just said, God. For his really the singers and the players of instruments, just to call upon to really do certain works, you know? Cigar. Hey, cigar. Hey, cigar. My cigar is big, cigar. Mr. Broderick. How are you today? You must be able to I'm see. Much I'm much I'm much well, I'm on to come a Rasta man now. But come to the light now and see up the light of Rasta Farai. In 66, really. I'm on full nuts in Rastafari. Well, Rastafari is a different side of the music. You see him? Rastafari is I and I religion. Hartically. It's a meditation. To be a Rastaman, I, I, I have myself really proud to be a Rastaman. And I have to give John thanks and praise. Hail Selassie I, mighty full trinity, king conqueror of Judah, you know? Selassie I, Rastafari. Right?
right now, we need, we need some facilities, food. I was singing a lot and singing, singing and not getting nothing. Nothing. Just pure, I mean, good name. Good name and bad vibration. So, for we to sing good song and make good rhythm, we need good management. That's what you need, good management. So if we can obtain good management, we will work and we will never stop singing until, until, until. We never stop singing. Congo, that's what Congo says. Never stop. A la lucha I know I know future and I really want to really see it up in it right now. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well I know future what we are tight up for right now. It's really a Monday and future still. Where's the bongo wati? I read, I read. Yeah. Monday and a must. The most. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah. With no apology. True phrase Joe, I know. Yeah, Joe. Yeah. Well, right now, we see that right now. I know I'm Congos. So I know if you had more in Monday and you know. Naturally, you know, Joe? Yeah, man. Joe yeah, repatriation is a man. I woke up. No, of course.
super. Chasing Days, Music of the Congos on Radio One. And everybody wondering what's happening. Well, he shall conquer the mighty spirit above as we learn to love. Thirty. Thirty. 
Because Smirnoff goes with anything. The only things that stay the same with Smirnoff are pure taste, unmatched quality, and the assurance that you'll find Smirnoff at the top. It leaves you breathless. Insist on Smirnoff, the vodka at the top.
Yeah, I'm gonna know only people that white people that like reggae music. Only for people, white people that like reggae music. Where yeah. do you go to listen to the music around here? Well, the more time I check nightclubs, you know. Um, now and then you have a little session sort of around, around your brethren's yard or something, but more time it's nightclubs. You know what I mean? The ones that the police ain't raided, of course. Is there a lot of problem about the police around here? Though? Yeah, yeah, it's heavy around here with the police. They know? come and raid the music? Well, not, not, not so much raid it, but they let you know that they don't like it. You know, they let you know that they don't really, really want to deal with that in this area, you know what I mean? Yeah. More time I feel so they're, they're afraid of it, really. Yeah. Are you um, working? Yeah, I'm working. Yeah. Was it easy to get a job? Well, not, not really, because the job I wanted to needed training, you know? try to spread something along to the black people, you know, of this community and of the world, actually. And true said, you don't really, really get sort of established, you know. Well, it, it is established, but not, not worldwide, you know, like, because the white man really and truly, they don't understand our, our music, you know, as such. Like, if we, if we put reggae in the chat, it might get to number five, and that's the furthest. To me, for instance, to me, when I listen to music, I listen to the words first, what they try to say to me, and then I listen to the beat. And the beat of the music is... It's like I'm back in Africa, you know? Because really and truly that every black man come from Africa, right? But it's only like, say, we over here, as a as just a generation. But when the time comes, we have to return back to Africa, you know. And when, when I listen to reggae music, it gives me this inspiration, you know, so that I'm in Africa as such.
what uh, what kind of music do you like? Right, strictly reggae music, you know. Yeah. Reggae music. You make you make music yourself. Yeah, man. I'm I'm have a group called W12. Out, you know. Can you tell me a bit about the group. Well, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a young group and more time to start from school days, you know. And we leave school now and we decide to so well, we want to make good use of our talent, you know. So we just get together and just form a group still. Yeah. And we call it W12 because that means we come from Shepherd's Bush, which is West 12 district. So we call it W12, you know, in memory of W12 still. What kind of things do you sing about? Well, it's mostly spiritual music we do with, you know. Yeah. Do you want to sing something now? Sing about the future. Sing about the future. What things going to happen? What's going to happen? What will be happening in the future? And what the people must look forward to. Yeah. You know. What do you think will happen in the future? Well, what would you like to happen? What would I like? I would like to see everyone, everyone, black and white, everybody unite. And that's the whole. True. That's the whole base of music. You know, people feel listen to music and hear what the music is really saying. You know, people just looking at it like they want to have, they want to go out and enjoy themselves. But the music is talking to you yeah. and it's trying to bring people together. I like the jazz. Yeah. If I was a teenager, about 40, I'd follow them. Like the jazz. You know what I mean? Yeah. I think they're the group to follow at the moment. Do you play music yourself? Yeah, saxophone. Yeah. Are you playing group? No, I just sort of session with anyone else. Yeah. Yeah. So where do you go and listen to music around here? Well, um, anyway, I like going at the Hundred Club and going crackers at Friday lunchtime. Yeah. What do you think of teaching the Maytals? Oh, great. Yeah. Great. Like them. Yeah, I like them. Oh, they're doing a new, al um, new live album. Yeah, it's coming out today. Today? Yeah. So they did it last, last night, did yeah. they? 